Oh, hello everybody, it's Wednesday. Let's put up a banner about the Skin Analyzer app. So we're ready for that. So welcome back to Wednesday, happy skin hour. Today we're going to do body care because we've done pretty much all the skincare sets and we're going to go over some again, but today's about body care. So first of all, I hope you had an amazing weekend. I hope you had a great Liberty weekend and you were able to get out and do some things on Monday with your family, at least outside if you couldn't have everybody inside. I know it's been a challenge. And you know what else has been a challenge? The weather has been a challenge. Think about it. Here we are in South Florida and it rained on Saturday and Sunday, but not enough to stop us doing things. But um, the fire is in California and all up and down the West Coast. I mean, they've got the air quality low in Portland, Oregon. I mean, all up and down that coast, up to Washington State. It's it's sad. It's terrible what's happening. And then look at the center of the state, Wyoming and, and Denver, Colorado. They had a, Denver had 101 degrees on Sunday. And on Tuesday morning, it snowed. On Monday, it fell down to 37 degrees from 101 to 37 in just a matter of 24 hours. It's crazy. So and you know what? It snowed yesterday and today and it's going back up again into the heat wave again later this week. So um, if you are able to enjoy your Monday, Labor Day weekend and had some fun and didn't labor too much, I am happy to, to hear that for you. And if you just had to stay inside and, and uh, be with your family just for that time, that's okay too. So let me see. Oh, Kim Halsey is on. I haven't got my banners. On. I haven't got my um, messages on because it's a little bit distracting but hey kim nice to see you again i'm so excited for kim her daughter's getting married next month october so things are happening and um so welcome everybody so today again is about body care we're going to do our usual we're going to have some games we're going to play we're going to win a prize today's prize is my skin illuminator it's it's like a bronzer, but it's not a bronzer per se. It's a skin illuminator. It looks like you have a natural illumination. You can put, you can mix it with your foundation and give yourself a, a glow with your foundation. You can put it underneath foundation or underneath powder and give yourself an illumination. Or you can put it very lightly with your moisturizer uh, if you're not wearing a foundation and still get like a healthy looking glow to your skin so this is today's prize our it's called um skin or oh, liquid illuminator i don't know if you, ah there it is liquid illuminator liquid illuminator so this is today's gift prize so let me see i'm only checking my watch because my sister's telling me who's on so Everybody shout out to my sister. Yay. Okay. So today we are still going to promote this Mary Kay Skin Analyzer. And Kim, thank you for sending me your picture about your eye shape so that I could help you with that. So thank you. If anybody else wants to send their eye shape to me, just as I said to everybody last week, look straight on. Don't raise your brows. Don't open your eyes. Don't do the smiley, smiley thing. Just straight on. And so we can look and see what your eye shape is. And I can help you with that. Also, the skin analyzer. Download the analyzer app. Take your selfie picture with the analyzer and look to see what it suggests you have, your regimen, your prescription, and send that to me. I'll send you some samples. What I want to do is I want to do a live Zoom skincare class for you for you invite a couple of your girlfriends let them send me their skin analyzer app i will send some samples out and we can do an online zoom class so everybody can see everybody and we can do it together we can do our cleansing we can do some masking we can do it together as a little party remember back in the day when we used to do mary Kay parties well, it's going to be on Zoom. So let me know. And as a hostess, I'm going to give you lots and lots and lots of free products. So if you're interested in getting two, three, four friends together um, on Zoom 
and we could just have a little evening in, just have a little girls' night in, and it doesn't matter where in the country they are, they can join you for a girls' night in. But they need to download this Skin Analyzer app, it's on your screen, and they need to send me their regimen so I can send them the correct products to use. Deal? Okay. So um, tonight I told you about the drawing and we're going to do some games. They're going to be trivia, idioms and riddles. So there will be some a little collection of everything. And of course you answer and you get points for answering. So um, tonight, as I said, is about skincare. You know what? I'm going to take this banner off and I am going to see. Okay. I actually did, I cheated, I put on the comments so I can see. Hi, Nopi, how are you? All right, I'm going to try not to look at it. All right, so skincare tonight. Let's talk about skincare. Just let me tell you up front, there's going to be some overlap. I told you that when I was going through some products because some products fall into the tongue wise category, some form into the lip category, but you know, it's all part of your body, but this is all about body care and some of them fall into the body care slash overlap category. So I'm going to start with our body care series because this has been seriously sold out during COVID. I think people are staying home, pampering themselves a little bit more. First of all, we have our satin body, satin body, indulgent shea wash. It's made with shea butter. It's got the shea butter. It in instantly, I'm going to read what the company says, instantly envelops skin in a rich lather. And when you feel the creamy bliss of shea butter and breathe in the fresh scent of white tea and citrus, you escape to a place where your senses are endlessly, pleasingly satisfied. In this oasis, you can recharge. Your skin will feel satiny smooth and instantly soft. Wow, who doesn't want to escape and recharge? Um, shea butter has been used for centuries to enrich. In fact, I believe it was back from Cleopatra's time. You know, Cleopatra, used, they say, used to bathe in milk. Uh, but that's lactic acid, and we now know it's good for your skin. But shea has been used for centuries to enrich and soften the skin. Shea butter in, in has a lot of omega-3s, which help to maintain the skin natural moisturizer. And the shea butter is a creamy hydration that helps skin lock in hydration. It's also the, the scent of these is the white tea and citrus scent. And this scent also features white tea and... Um, a customized blend of pink grapefruit, lemongrass, notes of cardamom, cherry blossom, and blooming jasmine. So this is our body care collection with the Shea Wash. And I can tell you, you just need a little tiny bit. You don't need to use an excess about of this because you just need a little bit and it lathers up beautifully, especially have one of those Belange sponges or a washcloth or just your hands. It lathers up beautifully. I don't know if you can see, but each of these, um, I had a challenge with this in the shower until I realized that the stripe across the top, it's hard to see. There you go. The stripe across the top is different on everyone. And so sometimes when I'm in the shower and I don't have my glasses on, that's the only way I can figure it out. So it starts with the Shea Wash. Then we do have the Shea Scrub, the Satin Body Revitalizing Shea Scrub. It's the same Shea Cream with the grapefruit and the, and the lemongrass and the tea and the citrus. It's all the scent is the same, but this has got little scrubbing beads. And what I've been finding since I've been wearing sandals all day long, I'm in the house. I'm just wearing sandals all day long. I am using this on my feet every single day. The scrub, if you can see where it says scrub, I'm using this on my feet every day. And I don't have any of that dry, cracky heels stuff, but this is wonderful on your legs and feet, um, arms, not necessarily all over the body, but it's great on the feet. So these two things are in the shower 
the, the shea scrub and the shea wash. And then, of course, when you get out of the shower and your body is still damp, you want to use the shea lotion. And again, you don't need a lot of the shea lotion. You don't need a lot of any of them. They last a tremendously long time. It's a huge tube, um, as you can see. It's way bigger than my hand. It goes from fingertips to past my watch band. So it's a good size tube. Those are, that's the Shea Body Care System. I should probably tell you how much they are so you know. Um, I forgot to prep my sister for that. But they are each 18. Each, three, oh, each of those is 18. And then part of that set also is the Whipped Body cream and that's a relatively new one i have one of my customers she keeps ordering it and i thought she was going through i'm sorry going through quite a lot of it and she tells me that her husband is using it i'm not sure where he puts it but her husband is using it again it is a beautiful whipped shea butter body balm it says whipped shea cream and this is what it looks like it's a whipped cream it's thick. It's very thick. It's a shea cream. And I actually use this on my feet at night. So this is a really good product for your heels and for your feet. So this shea cream, it's one of the three things that I use on my feet. But this is a great shea cream. It's a whipped body butter with the same shea ingredients, the same white tin citrus smell. So it's part of this shea body collection. So that is our body collection. And then the newest addition to our body collection is our Satin Hands Shea Hand Soap. This has just been released. In fact, you probably won't even see it on the website until, well, actually you may see it there as the first of this month, um, officially on the 16th, but it might be on the, on the website. It's our Shea Hand Wash. And this also has the shea butter ingredients in it because we're washing our hands so much that this has got the shea in it. So it's going to help to moisturize your hands. This is fragrance free. This doesn't have a fragrance. So this is a fragrance free hand wash. I'm not going to pump it because then I'll have it all over me. But um, this is a great shea hand wash. And if you're thinking gifts, I know Mother's Day has passed, but if you're thinking gifts for the holidays or if you're thinking um, hostess gifts if you're going anywhere for Thanksgiving or Christmas. I know that seems like forever away. I mean, we're still in the summer. But just think about gifts. And this is a great little gift. This is only 10. So you can take her a great shea wash, hand wash, um, which will actually go with our shea hand cream. But that's what we're going to talk about. Our shea body collection, shea wash, shea scrub, shea lotion, and the whipped shea cream and our newest addition, the fragrance-free shea hand soap. Okay, we're going to do a game. I am going to do, let's see. Okay, <clears throat> I'm going to do some word games. So um, it's, it's a phrase that we all know. It's called an idiom. And if it's somebody who's stubborn, we say they are stiff, something. A clue is a body part. So an idiom is an expression that we typically use to mean something. And usually we say if somebody's stubborn, we call them stiff something. It's a body body part. Stiff something. Um, don't let your minds go in the gutter. <laughs> I didn't think about that when I wrote this one. Okay. Stubborn. Stiff body part. <laughs> I was doing that before my sister said something because she would say something. But, okay. So if you call somebody stiff something, it means they're stubborn. What is that word? It's also a biblical word too. So just to let you know. Okay. So keep getting that game. The next set I want to talk about is our satin hands. Ah, Kim Halsey. Uh, Joanne, I think I'm see. Thank you, Kim, for saving my bacon. <laughs> Thank you, Kim. I see Kim did stiff-necked. Yep. If somebody's stiff-necked, they are stubborn. In fact, in the in the Old Testament, in, in Genesis 
And in the Bible, when Moses was leading them out of Egypt, um, he called them a stiff-necked people. So <laughs> thank you, Kim. I won't use that one again. Thank you for saving my bacon. <laughs> okay, stiff neck. All right, let us go on. Satin Hands, if you've been around Mary Kay any length of time, you know that Satin Hands is a collection that has been around for a while. It is an amazing collection. The first part of this collection is our Satin Hands Protecting Softener. And just a little FYI, this is also the Extra Emollient Night Cream. Um, and I'm going to go more about that. But this and the Extra Emollient Night Cream are the same product, just that the Extra Emollient Night Cream has got a pink color. And this is clear light, clear, just a clear one. But this is the first part. And you put this on and you rub it in. The warmer, the more you rub, the warmer it gets and the more softened and the dead skin is softened. Then you're going to use the hand scrub and it's the satin hands satin smoothie refining shea scrub and so this is a scrub it's going to you're going it's going to soak it up and it's going to scrub and it's going to get off the extra emollient it's going to get off all the dead skin and then you're going to dry your hands wash off wash off everything around the cuticles remember to wash off around the cuticles push them back not with your fingers not with your nails, just with your fingers. Just pull your cuticles back. Wash everything. Wash underneath the nails. Dry off everything. And then use a little drop of the Nourishing Shea Cream. This is an amazing product. This product, you can stand alone. We gave, uh, those of you who helped me, gave we gave 171 hand creams to the hospitals when COVID first came out because the women were just their hands were so dry so dry this will actually help to moisturize your hands for up to three washes especially if you're going to use a shea hand wash so for the nurses these two things will be amazing so this is our satin hands collection it retails for 36. this is our most popular mother's day product and it is an extremely popular Christmas product. I'm just letting you know that this is one of the most popular and this is what the nurses were asking for also during COVID when it started. It does come with an explanation of how to use it, set in hands pampering set, the steps. It comes in the white tea and citrus which also remember has um, grapefruit and lemongrass, notes of cardamom, cherry blossom and blooming jasmine. It also comes in the fragrance free for anybody who doesn't like fragrance, although that is a very light fragrance. And I have a few of last Christmas's um, pomegranate. In fact, tell my sister to plug her ears because she wanted one of these hand creams. And I told her the only way I could give it to her was in a set. So plug my sister's ears because this is the pomegranate blissful pomegranate hand cream and now I don't have any of the individual hand creams left they're just in the set so if you think you want one for yourself or for a gift I only have a few left I'm just letting you know I overstocked last Christmas because I knew they were going to be popular plus I love the color and I love the smell I've got this in my guest bathroom so um let me tell you if you get it don't tell my sister because she's going to come to your house and steal the hand cream I'm just letting you know that. So just, just sharing that with you. I've got a little, oh, and the hand creams, of course, come separately. And we can do the Satin Hands hand cream in the um, white tea and citrus and in the fragrance free. So you can get those separately and you can get part of the set. A lot of people will take this with them, like nurses will have it with them in their lockers. I when I was working in an office, would take one with me. Um, I have one on my desk. It's here all the time. So I can, you can have your hand cream separate to your satin hands collection. So I do have a little video to share with that. And let me see if I can do the screen share, do a quick video on that. And um, let's see. I think I have two. They're very, they're very short. So I'm going to do share screen, share audio. Tab. Let's see. Um, 
All right, let's see if we got this going on. Every day, my hands make life happen. And every day, my hands deserve to escape, to seal in precious moisture, polish away dry skin, and wrap skin in instant hydration. Give yourself an extra dose of indulgence. Introducing the new Satin Hands Pampering Set, featuring a new scrub and hand cream powered by Nourishing Shea Butter. Available only through your Mary Kay Independent Beauty Consultant. Okay, I've got another one I want to show you, and this is how she uses it. So I'm going to do this one. It's only like a minute long. Um, so let's do this one. And we're going to share this one. Let's see. Hey there, we're Fit It Young here to talk to you about one of Mary Kay's favorite products. My favorite product, a Mary Kay staple. If you ask me, and of course I'm talking about Mary Kay's satin hands. So why don't you join me for a little bit of R&R? &R? And I'm not talking about rest and relaxation. I'm talking about rejuvenate and revitalize. I don't know about you, but I want my hands looking youthful. I want them feeling silky. And that's exactly what is going to happen. So let's start with Mary Kay's hand softener. That is going to protect, fill in all the dry cracks, spots, anything like that. It's going to feel and look a little bit thick, but it feels amazing this does come in a white tan citrus what we're using today and also a fragrance free next we want to go ahead and use our shea scrub and this shea scrub is gentle enough for you to use every single day that's why if you came into my home you'd find it by almost every sink smells amazing pink grapefruit lemongrass so let's rinse that off and so oh my gosh this feels amazing no soap necessary and so you can go ahead and dry that off and then that last step is going to be that hand cream and that shea hand cream is going to moisturize you for up to 24 hours it's amazing my favorite thing to gift by far is this set because it's amazing for bride to bees expecting mom because anytime that you tell me that i don't need an extra gift bag that it already comes in this cute convenient bag boom slap a bow on it you are done mary Kay satin hands okay so that's the satin hands girls and so Think about that for yourself or for gift giving. All right, so now we're going to do another game. Um, let's see. Okay, I'm going to do a word picture game. So I want you to put on your thinking cap. I'm going to show you the picture. And this is, you have to really think now, um, what does this mean? It's a three-word three, three word noun it describes something and here's a hint they have them in england so what does this picture say to you so think about this they're very prominent in england what does it mean okay i'm giving you a minute you really have to use your brain aha uh -huh. somebody got it Thank you. I think that was Annalisa. And yes, she is right. Double decker bus. Double decker bus. Oh, did I see Karima Houghton just jump on? Yay, Karima. Great. Okay. Congratulations, Joanna. Thank you for, you know what? I Thank you for doing all this for me and keeping me on track. And I appreciate you so much. All right. Um, the satin hand sets were 36. The hand creams are 12. All right, let's now talk about one of these things that I told you was going to be a crossover because we've talked about this before. Let's see. Um, I was just listening to my, watching my sister's text. Okay, so one of the crossover things is satin lips. It's because it's part of our satin body collection. If you notice the box, is the same and it's also got the white tea maybe it doesn't let's see 
Um, it has a little light scent to it, but it is shea butter balm and shea butter scrub. They're teeny tiny, but let me see if I can get it so it can see it. There we go. The satin lips. This is the shea butter scrub. It's a scrub. You have to put it on your finger, and then what you do is you put it all around your lips, all around the outside and on the lips. It actually gets the dead skin off the lips. It is an amazing product because it gently exfoliates all the dead skin. We were talking about it during the mask last week when we were talking about the, the mask acne and what's happening in our face. We're not wearing lipsticks. We're not wearing a lot of lip balms. We are licking our lips. Our lips are dry. Believe it or not, in that moist atmosphere, our lips are really dry and some people's lips are getting cracked. So this is going to help to exfoliate the dead skin around the lips. And if you've been in the sun a lot, like maybe you're at the beach over the weekend or if you're in Denver and you were in the snow yesterday, all this is part of the you know solution to these chapped dry lips. So you use the Satin Lips Lip Balm all over the lips and you want to do little circular motions and you want to do it before you wash your face because there is um an ingredient here that's going to help to soften the lips while it's scrubbing it so you want to leave it on for a moment not hours not ask you to walk around the house with it i'm just asking you to put it on right before you wash your face and then just wash everything off and then of course the satin lips lip balm again it's in this same packaging like the satin the Satin Hands, it's part of this whole collection, which is why it's doubling over with us. This is the Satin Lips Shea Butter Lip Balm. Now, this can be used as often as you want. It's got a, this kind of applicator. I'm giving you some shades. So it would, you could apply it straight to your lips like this as often as you needed to. The scrub, you only need to use it two to three times a week. I always tell my ladies that the more you use it, the less you need to use it. But if you use this about three times a week, and you can use this Satin Lips Shea Butter Balm every day. It's got a little light antiseptic in it too to help to heal any cracks in the lips. So I've had a lot, I have a lot of men who use this. I've got a guy, he's a husband of one of my clients, and he works outside and he, he gets this all the time. He doesn't do this. He doesn't do the scrub, but he does the balm. He buys them two at a time. And I've had teens who are on the um, rowing team, uh, you know, a college rowing team, and they get the satin lips set a lot. So it's a really good set for the lips. And I put it in part of the body because it is part of the satin collection, satin, satin lips. And I often find that, it goes as a set with the satin hands and the satin lips. So that's a good set. The other one I want to talk about, it's it's also, I just put it with the greens because it's a foot cream. It's called the Mary Kay Mint Bliss Energizing Lotion for Feet and Legs. If you have got tired legs, this is really energizing when back in the day last year when we were going to conferences and we were walking on conference floors and our feet were tired and our, even our legs was our legs were tired i'd always take this with me to conference and even now it's remember i told you earlier it's one of the three things i use for my feet this is one of the three and right now there's a gift if you're going to get this that the mint bliss it's this size it's you know it, it's a reasonable size um the mint bliss there yeah, mint energizing lotion for feet and legs you are going to get a pair of socks fuzzy socks and either looks like this or it looks like this love my fuzzy socks so you can put these on at night this on at night and then you can wrap your feet in fuzzy socks and stay all night and your feet feel delicious in the morning. Doesn't matter which lotion you use on your feet, you can still use the fuzzy socks. So this is the Mint Bliss Energizing Lotion for feet and legs. It's got obviously a slight minty flavor and it, it feels energizing. It feels minty on the legs. I don't know how to explain it. You know, when you use mint on something and it's got that little zing, not a, not a, not a sting, just a little, oh, 
that feels so good. So this is the Mint Bliss Energizing Lotion for Feet and Legs. And this is 11. So this, again, is a great gift. Um, typically, we'll do this a lot. We'll do uh, adopt a grandparent and we'll... I used to collect these and take to nursing homes for the ladies and gentlemen who really don't get much gifts for Christmas because I always thought they need something for their feet and they always need a pair of fuzzy socks when they're in bed because your feet get so cold in bed. So that's the other two ones that I wanted to talk about. So I'm going to do another game. Okay, let's do another game. Let's talk about what we're going to do. This one is going to be... Um, probably you're going to look it up on Google, who knows, but it's Georgia's, Georgia, the state of Georgia, 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 G-E-O-R-G-I-A, I speak funny, the state vegetable. What is the state vegetable of the state of Georgia? What is the state vegetable? And one of the names of the state vegetable has a city of Georgia name in it. So state vegetable for Georgia. Okay, while you're thinking about that, I'm going to go ahead and we're going to talk about the next products. Um, let's see what we got here. Okay. It's another two crossover products. So another two crossover products because, again, it's part of the body. And we covered this when we were doing the TimeWise. So the TimeWise Body Targeted Action Toning Lotion. This is amazing we talked about um we talked about the wow cream this is the wow cream and i know if elaine is on elaine if you're on and you're using it you let me know you let them know how you like it this is crazy 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 good this is actually going to really 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 hydrate your skin and Anytime any, I've got a new user with it, I'll give you a challenge. Use it on one arm or one leg for a week. Don't touch the other one. And then look at the difference. This has got a light grapefruit scent. It's part of the TimeWise collection, but it is essential for crepey or dry skin. You know, as we get older, our skin gets thinner, depending on the, you know, the time of year, the skin gets dry. This stuff is amazing and the story of the wow cream is when i met my not yet husband he's now deceased but when i met him um he would feel my skin and he would say wow your skin is so soft and this was it so it was called the wow cream and so i mean i called it the wow cream and this has been around for years but it's actually a toning Targeted action toning lotion. It's going to help to tighten the skin. It's going to help to tighten the flabbies. Um, it's not going to do what your gym does. I'm just letting you know that. But it tones and tightens the skin. And more importantly, it it firms the skin. Let me show you what the, 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 the box shows. This is the before and after picture. And, of course, this is magnification of the skin. I don't know if you can see that. All right. So this is the before. Do you see how the skin is lumpy, crepey? I'm going to see if I can get it at a better, better angle. This is the before, the crepey, crepey, lumpy before. Let's see if I can get the camera better. Not so much. And then this is the after where the skin is smoother. And that was, um, that was the Mary Kay had done, taken those pictures after four weeks. 77% said their skin looked toned. 81 said their skin looked firmer. And after eight weeks, 68% said the body contours were firmed. Let me tell you, 94% said the skin appeared smoother. It's great for your skin. Um, so somebody, oh, somebody, Karima. Karima, I think you answered Vidalia onions. You're exactly right. That is Georgia, Georgia's state vegetable a Vidalia onion isn't that funny it's actually Vidalia sweet onion so um wow cream oh look you can see now before and after okay wow cream again that's another one of my crossovers because we talked about it before the other crossover is is part of the Mary Kay collection part of the Mary Kay time wise collection 
is this extra emollient night cream. Remember I told you at the beginning, out of the satin hands, this is the same product, but this is the standalone one. This one is unscented and clear that comes in the satin hands. It's clear. Can you see that? Just a clear ointment, um, softening ointment. But the satin hands, the extra emollient night cream is actually very lightly scented and it is just colored a light pink. But it's the same product. It is the exact same product. This was actually one of Mary Kay's favorite products. Um, in fact, she had dry skin and she would use this every night. So that's why it's called Extra Emollient Night Cream. So if you want to use it on your dry skin, um, again, I've had customers who went to Colorado skiing and I would send them with this because what you do is you put a little bit in the center of your hand. I'm not going to do it now. Just put a little. And then you add a few drops of water and you mix the water and the and the extra emollient night cream. It becomes almost a milky cream. And then you just take it, make it warm, and you spread it all over your face and your neck. And this is really a very moisturizing. Now, this is one of the other things I use on my feet. This is, I'll even put on the energizing foot first and then put this on top because this one is thick. If you use this on your feet, you really do want to wear socks because if you get up in, in the middle of the night, you do want to have socks on. But this, if you put this on your feet and you just leave it with socks on and in the morning you wonder whose feet jumped into your bed with you because this, will make your feet just amazingly outstanding. Also, um, one of my customers told me when her when COVID first came, her cuticles were bleeding, and this is what I sent her. And this is a really good treatment for hands and cuticles, for face, for feet, for everything. So this is the Extra Amalia Night Cream, which is the same one as in the set in hands. But again, it's one of those crossover pieces. I can't break up the set for the set in hands unless you want to give my sister the pomegranate lotion and then you can keep the fragrance-free one. Otherwise, this is what you have to get if you're just getting that. So those are two more of the crossover products. Okay, we're going to do another game. Um... I think from what I'm seeing a little bit, Joanna, you have to let me know, but you can you can let them know. I think there was a tie. Karima and Annalisa got the onion. Okay, don't cry. So good, good, good. All right, so now um, here's another one. All right, here's another idiom. And again, an idiom is something we say, a saying that we say, but it means something. So if you are going to reveal a secret to somebody, you tell them, okay, go ahead and spill the. So reveal a secret. You want to say to them, okay, spill the. What's that answer? Okay. Um, let's see. I forgot to tell you the extra emollient night cream by itself is 15. Um, I think I should have told you that already. So... 15 extra emollient night cream and the body, the wow cream, the body care cream. Um, my absolute favorite is, I think it's 32, 32, 32. Yep. 32. My favorite. I think if I had to be stuck on a desert Island and could only take one thing, I think this is what I would take. I really do. I think this is what I would take. Maybe I'd have to take sunscreen, but I'd take this. So maybe two things. Okay. So 15 on that cream, 32 on the wow cream. Um, and let's see, did anybody get, let's see, spill the something? Yep, I think um, Kim got spill the beans. Okay, if you're telling somebody to share a secret, you're telling them to spill the beans. Yay! These games aren't too difficult, are they? Double Decker Boss was probably the most challenging. I've got one, a really challenging one, a riddle for the end. All right, last group of products we're going to go over for body care 
is of course sun care because that's important our body did you know that your skin is the largest organ of your body it is a living breathing organ it's almost the most important almost I don't know they're all important because if you didn't have a heartbeat you wouldn't be alive if you didn't have a brain you couldn't function or speak but if you didn't have skin you wouldn't be so the skin the whole skin it's our largest organ in our body and it is a functioning living breathing organ so we have to look after it and the sunscreen is important because do you realize that 20 percent of aging is actually ages in years and 80 percent of the visible signs of aging is because of environmental damage and of that 90 percent of visible signs of aging on non-melanoma skin cancers is the result of this sun so this is important the sun causes cancer skin cancers it causes um um basal cell squamous cell and the terrible terrible melanoma so you really want to keep a sunscreen on now the the seal of approval this american cancer society seal of approval that's what it would look like skin cancer recommended skin cancer foundation um that is the american cancer society skin cancer foundation seal of approval and it takes a lot to get that designation because they have to do a lot of testing so we have a sun sun care sunscreen i'm going to try and get it in focus for you um spf 50 maybe it'll be easier to show you the box sunscreen spf 50 spf 50 um it is water resistant for 80 minutes and it protects you from the sun, UVA and UVB rays. Let me do a little teaching. UVA rays, if you think A is for aging, UVA rays cause the aging of the skin. And UVB stands for burning. The UVB rays are the burning rays, which are also the skin cancer rays. Those are the ones that go deeper. The UVA rays are the surface ones, the UVB rays. No, I think it's the other way around. Um, anyway, UVA is for aging. Yes, those are the deeper ones. The UVB is for burning. So UVA rays are present year-round, penetrating clouds, mist, fog, and glass. So even in your car, they also reflect off water, snow, sand, and pavement. So protecting your skin with a broad-spectrum sunscreen, meaning it blocks both UVA and UVB, that's what broad-spectrum means, is an everyday, 365 days a year must. Now, I wonder if you know what you uh, the SPF stands for. The SPF is Sun Protection Factor, and it it doesn't matter what color your skin is because dark skin can burn and light skin can burn. But your SPF changes based on your skin color. So to find your SPF, you want to go out in the, about the middle of the day. You want to be out in the sun. How long would it take for you to burn, to get pink? Now, of course, that doesn't show up right away. So... You just have to gauge it. But if it takes about 15 minutes for your skin to get pink, like it's starting to burn, um, and of course, the darker the skin, the longer it would take, that would be your SPF factor. With my skin, it's about 15 to 20 minutes for me to, in the direct sun with no sun protection, I, I would get a pinkish hue, a burn on my skin. That's my factor, 20 minutes. So if I want to protect my skin, for five hours, I would have to take the five hours times 60 minutes, which is 300 minutes. And then I divide that by my factor of 20. So an SPF in a would essentially give me an SPF. I'm sorry, I should have divided by 50. The SPF 50 she would have effectively given me about five hours of sun protection. But that doesn't mean a one-time application is going to give me five hours. 
you have to keep applying every 80 minutes, eight zero. I was on a cruise once and I, I said this fact that we have to apply every 80 minutes. And one smart aleck guy said, yes, about the amount of time that we go to the dining room or we go and to the buffet and eat every 80 minutes. They say you're supposed to put about the amount of a shot glass to cover your body. So it's about an ounce to cover your body. And you're supposed to reapply every 80 minutes. But find out what your factor is. And then you multiply your factor by the SPF factor. And then you'll know how long protection you have in the sun. That's how you work it. So whatever it is. So a 50 gives pretty much everybody a good protection factor. So our SPF, our um, sun care SPF 50 has a sci berry extract which has been reported to neutralize free radicals at a potency rate more than 80 times higher than green tea, making it an antioxidant superpower. It's got vitamin E with a skin soothing, vitamin E is a, a, a tocopherol with skin soothing benefits. It's got glycerin, which is an emollient to help balance or maintain proper moisture in skin levels. And it's got the sun ingredients, the UVA and the UVB ingredients in it to reduce the risk of skin cancer and to reduce the risk of premature skin aging. So we have this with an SPF 50 and we've got its companion lip product. It's, um, oh, it's always hard to get it here. Lip protector sunscreen SPF 15. And this is our lip protector sunscreen it's a little lip balm. You just turn it up like this and you use it to protect your lips. This you can use every day, particularly in South Florida. I mean, this is every day under lipstick, every day under your mask, every day the SPF 15 with your lip protector. So these two products are super important. Um, golfing. If you or your husband or your boyfriend or your brother or your uncle or anybody goes golfing, this product, give this to them. Because we we always forget that the sun gets on our lips. We can get the sores on our lips from the sun. They call them cold sores, which is funny because the sun will bring them out, stress. But this will help to reduce any burning on the sun. My grandson right now is working outside and I saw the other day that he had really a, a burn on his lip. I said, well, that's from, he said, I've just been working outside. So of course he had to go home with one of these, a sun protection for the lips. So these two products. Okay, the other product we've got in this line is our after sun replenishing gel. And this after sun replenishing gel it um, has got aloe in it, but it really is going to help to neutralize the burn and to soothe the skin. This is an amazing product. This, this product, it's a seasonal product for us. It comes out in the summer, but it's used extensively now. The company has um, certified it for after sun to help to ease that burn and stop the blistering, hopefully, if the burning is not too bad, and to soothe the skin. A lot of people will keep it in the fridge, but I can tell you there's other uses for it that the company hasn't tested for, so I'm not officially allowed to tell you, but I can tell you people have used it for cradle cap on babies. Um, oh, talking of which, the sunscreen can be used, no, that's the wrong one. The sunscreen can be used from infants of a year up. So this can be, in fact, I've had people who've used it on nine months, but the company says one year and older, just letting you know. Okay, um, this after sun replenishing gel, it really is a great gel. If you've got a sunburn, cradle cap, eczema. Um, when my husband had cancer and he had to have radiation here and he got a tremendous burn from the radiation, this is what we used on it because it was a burn and he was going down to Uni Miami, University of Miami Sylvester Cancer Center and the nurse manager on the radiation floor was so impressed with how his skin hadn't broken down after six weeks. I mean, it did break down on the last week of treatment, six weeks of radiation. She asked me what I was using and I had to give her one. I've had women who are, had, who are going through radiation therapy for breast cancer and I'll give them this because this really does help 
to stop the burn, whether it's from sun or the radiation burn. So this, ladies, is something I always keep on hand because you never know who's going to need one. Um, as I say, they're seasonal for us, but this is this is an amazing product. And I saw it work firsthand on my husband's radiation burn on his neck, which was pretty ugly. So I'm just letting you know that. All right. So those are the, the sunscreen, the after sun replenishing gel, the lip protector. But if you want to look like you've sunburned, sun, sun bronzed, being a sun babe without the sun, without the dangers of the sun, here it is. This is your sunless tanning lotion, sunless tanning lotion. And this one is very gentle. It's not going to turn you orange overnight. In about a week, if you used it every day, in about a week, you'd be developing a tan. And it really does work. It looks very natural. It stays different on every skin tone. It looks like a natural tan. It's really quite amazing. I like to put it with my... my wow cream and mix them together because I get really a nice smooth finish. I don't like any stripes or streaks with this, but you're not going to get that. It's not a developing an hour product. It's, it's you know, like developing a week product, but this is your after uh, subtle tanning lotion. Subtle. It takes about a week. So Kim, wedding, if you don't want to be in the sun and dry out your skin, this could be something for the legs, the arms, whatever. Just letting you know. So this is one of the products we can talk about. So that was our skin care we've done tonight and our sun care because sun is part of, I mean, skin is part of our, wait, no. Our skin is damaged by the sun, so we need that. So I think that's about it. I'm going to finish up with one game. And this one is a riddle. And riddles, I've never had good luck with riddles, but I'm going to see if I can give you a clue on this. So, what can travel around the world while staying in a corner? What can travel around the world while staying in a corner? Around the world. Around the U.S. and internationally. What can travel around the world while staying in a corner? And it's a thing not a person. It's a thing, not a person. All right, I got a question here. How much is the lip balm? Okay, this, I'm sorry, I should have told you. The sunscreen is 20. The lip balm is 10. And the after sun replenishing gel is, I think it's 16. And the sunless tanning lotion, I believe, is about the same. It's not in this full book because it was a seasonal product, but I'll let you know. So, how much is the lip balm? Ten. Okay. Um, what can travel around the world while staying in a corner? Good question. Do you need a hint? Do you need a hint? It's a thing. And it's... Mm, it's a thing that sticks. It's a sticky thing. Yay, who said a stamp? I don't know who said a stamp, but that is correct. What can travel around the world while staying in a corner? A stamp. I don't know who got that, but yes. Okay, so let me finish up here. So ladies, um, if you wanted to do a, if you want to book a Mary Kay get together of your own, you can either invite them to come here on a Wednesday or Glamour on a third, on a Friday. Wednesday at 7 for skin, Fridays for Glamour. Invite them to come or invite two or three or four of your friends and we do a Zoom party. But remember, you have to ask them to send me the Skin Analyzer app and I will send them samples and we can Zoom together and spend a half an hour to an hour just treating our faces in Zoom, and we can watch each other just like we used to do around the table. So let's talk about booking your own. Now, girls, I'm in a challenge. I don't know if you saw my Facebook post, but I'm in a challenge to triple, triple, triple my business in September. So I'm asking you to host a gathering, a little Zoom gathering, or bring people here, and I will reward you 
lavishly, okay? Lavishly. I'm just letting you know that. So thank you for being on tonight. Um, 10% off always. If you join me here, you get 10% off anything you order tonight. And my sister will tally up the points. And whoever is going to get the liquid illuminator, and this is good for all skin tones. It doesn't matter what your skin tone is. If you are actually ebony, it might be too light for you, but everything from bronze all the way down to ivory, this is a, a great product. So, Joanna, do we have a total yet? Can I announce it? Let's see. If not, I'll just post it. I'll just post it. I'll just post it. I haven't got the, the number yet. So I'm going to jump off um, and I will post it right here. Who won the liquid illuminator? And I'm going to keep you up because thank you. It's been 55 minutes and my goal is to keep this always under one hour. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you next week. Have a great week. See you Friday. See you Friday for Glamour. Bye. Oh, let's see. Oh, everyone has two points. Everyone has two points. Okay, we'll figure this out. Bye.